Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Abby and today I'm back for just a day in my life video. I run an in-home daycare out of my house so I thought I'd take you along our day and show you what I do all day. Um, so I usually get up around 6 a.m. and I get myself ready for the day, um, brush my teeth, put in my contacts, uh, do a little bit of skincare, and then I head into my bedroom and I do my makeup. Oh, I did get dressed first and then I went into my bedroom and put on my makeup um sometimes I don't put on makeup sometimes sometimes I do but if I do it's just like a very little bit I just always feel a little bit better when I have a little bit of makeup on and I try to do a little something with my hair to just I don't know I just feel a little bit better when I put a little bit of effort it effort in in the morning uh, and then I head downstairs and I fill up my water bottle for the day and then I usually go into the living room and do my bike pedals for 30 minutes um, you just scroll on my phone while I do that and then um, there I am I did it for 30 minutes and 42 seconds today um, then I head into the kitchen and make myself some breakfast head into the dining room and I eat my breakfast then after that I do some Bible journaling and I read about a chapter a day in the Bible um, while I wait for the kiddos to get here my first girlie got here probably around 7 30 and I brought all of her food into the kitchen put her lunch away I tried to see if she wanted her bottle but she didn't so we headed into the living room and we just started playing with toys while we waited for more of her friends to come Then some more of our friends started showing up and when everybody gets here I always just take each time somebody gets here I take their lunches into the kitchen and just go through and put anything that needs to be refrigerated into the fridge and then everything else just stays in their lunch bag and I leave that on the shelf today we were watching some Masha and Bear they really like that show and we just uh, spent the first part of our morning playing with toys as you can see they got a lot out I let some of the bigger kids uh, play with some of my Barbies too. let them hang out in the dining room and they played Barbies played with some drawers uh, I'm not sure what else they played with this day but I like to give my big kids some space to play um, away from the little kids sometimes when I can and then here I am just setting out morning snack for everybody little one did not want her yogurt today <laughs> she like sometimes will take a couple bites and then she won't eat it today she didn't eat any of it um, and here I'm trying to teach her how to put her cup away she's doing pretty good with it um, we're still working on it though and um, sometimes she gets distracted and I have to bring her back to go back in the living room and play and then I brought out some puzzles for the big kids to play with for a little bit um, they really like those and this is like a new little cupcake activity I made for them so they played with that for a little bit too. And then we cleaned up the room. The kiddos did a great job cleaning everything up and they got a star. And then we all went and put our shoes on because we went for a walk this day. I can't remember where we went, but you'll find out in a second. Um, or we might have just played out front today. I think we actually just played out front today. We didn't go for a walk. We thought about going for a walk but we decided to play out front. That's what the kids wanted to do instead. And I did buy them some new chalk um, that I forgot about. So we do end up playing with that for a little bit. Here 
here is the new chalk that I got. I just got it at Walmart, dumped it into our basket of chalk, and they were so excited to have brand new chalk. All of our chalk pieces were so small. Um, I have these rocks that they like to color uh, sometimes, or we just color on my little step here or on the sidewalk. And we got a couple balls out and played with those too. Um, and we just spent the next part of our morning outside playing. And then we came back inside and I'm just setting up their lunches. And I didn't show this, but anytime we come back from being outside, after the kids take off their shoes, the big kids go to the bathroom and wash their hands. And then the little kids, I just wipe their hands off with a wipe, just so that their hands are clean from being outside. And we usually eat lunch right after we come back from outside. So I want their hands to be clean for that. But yeah, here I am setting up all their lunches. Um, the kiddos are just in the living room watching a show and I have a tablet set up that I can see them while I'm setting up lunches. But yeah, we're just going to eat some lunch and then we'll get into the next activity in a second. After lunches, I always clean up dishes and wipe down counters and set out snacks, put lunch boxes away. And while I'm doing all that, the kids do dancey songs and then they watch a TV story. I ha that just gets them onto the couch. Um, and it allows me a few minutes to set out all of their nap beds. It also gives them a few minutes to kind of decompress from being crazy and doing dancey songs. And after the TV story, I do read them a book. There's everybody's beds laid out. Um, and let's see what book we picked for the day. We picked this Poppy Surprise book. I can't remember who picked it today, but I usually try to let them take turns picking. And then they all went to sleep pretty easily today. A couple of my girlies do stay up and play iPads during nap time. But yeah, and then I eat my lunch. And then before I get the kids up, I do set out their snacks so that it's ready for them. I get them up usually around three. I have the big girls um, put away their iPads. They got a little twisted here, so I had to help them. The headphones got a little twisted. Um, but yeah, they went and put their iPads away and then I went in and woke up the little kids and had them start cleaning up their beds. That's something else I'm working on with the littlest one. I'm working on her learning how to put her cup away and also putting her nap mat away. I help her roll it up and then she carries it into the hallway and puts it where it needs to go. Sometimes she gets a little confused about where it goes, but she's doing a really good job with that. And the other kids do really good at putting their beds away too. And then here's everybody just eating their snacks. Um, and while they're eating snack, I just go into the hallway and put all of their nap beds away. Um, the blue and red mats go in that bin and then the blankets go into that closet right there. And then after they're finished with snack, the kiddos clean up everything. They all clean up their stuff after every time they eat the baby wouldn't go. I had to give her a little pat to get her going. Um, but um, anyways, the kids do a really good job cleaning up their stuff after snacks and lunchtime. They know, you know, their cups go in the fridge or if they need more, they put it on the counter. They know what goes in the garbage or what goes on the counter or in the sink. Um, they all do such a good job and it just takes time to, you know, you work with them when they're this age, when they're really little. Um, she did not want to go in the living room, but you just work with them when they're little and eventually they pick it up. And by the time they're like three, usually by the time they're two and a half, they can um, mostly clean up everything by themselves and they do a really good job.
I just hung out in the living room with my littlest one and my two big girls really wanted to play that cupcake game again so I let them sit at the table and play that while I just hung out with the baby. Um, the baby was being like a little bit fussy, so I decided to put on some dancey songs for her, but she, I don't know, I think she, maybe she was still tired, um, but she just did not really feel like doing much of anything, so we just hung out, and yeah, she, oh, I did read a book, we might have read a book, I honestly can't remember what we did, but I just hung out with her, and that was basically our day today. Alrighty, friends, that is pretty much most of our daycare day, um, the kids have about 25 minutes left and then they're all gonna leave within the next 25 minutes. I'm just gonna keep dancey songs on. The big girls are playing with some toys in here a little bit. Um, I have two in the dining room playing with some like big kid toys and then two littler ones in the living room. We're doing dancies and they're just kinda hanging out playing. Um, but yeah, that wraps up our day. So I hope you enjoyed it. I decided to do more of a um, just video voiceover type video this time. I haven't done one of these in a while. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below and press that subscribe button if you haven't already. Also, come find me over on Instagram and TikTok if you haven't come over there to find me yet. I post other content over there. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.